morning, you guys. It is 1.25 in the morning at the moment. I am getting ready to leave here soon to go to my mom's um, so that we can go to work. Uh, but I got home super late last night. Well, super late. Um, my mother-in-law went and took me to get food for dinner, for me at least. Um, we got stuff for Riker and the baby, but I had to go to bed early. Um, we got home, I ate, we watched the season finale of Hawkeye. Um, and then I went to bed. So I went to bed super early because I worked. I work at 2.30, I have to be at my mom's by 1.45. Um, but I wanted to explain what happened today. So, I got there, um, they asked me a few questions, I answered, the doctor came in, he had started doing the ultrasound to see if he could see anything, but my bladder was too full, so, um, he told me to empty it completely, um, they had me pee in a cup as well. Um, they wanted to test my urine. Um, Riker does know all of this um, because we're kind of at a waiting period at the moment. Um, but I wanted to come on here and explain things before I forgot. Um, so he, they had asked me when the last time I tested was, and that was a little bit over a week ago. Um, and I had told him that. He said, what was the result? I said it was positive. Um, they tested my urine just in case. Um, the pregnancy test did come out positive. Um, so then he decided he wanted to do an internal ultrasound. Um, <clears throat> he inserted the wand. Um, he didn't see anything, unfortunately. Um, but it could mean that I'm just really early. Um, and it's not showing up yet. Um, he checked my fallopian tubes to make sure that there wasn't an egg or an embryo in my tubes. Um, there wasn't. Everything looked great. Um, they, we decided to draw my blood. And um, I am going to go back on Monday for them to draw my blood again. If the levels are going up, it means I'm having a successful pregnancy and it's just too early to tell on the ultrasound. And if the levels are going down than what they were at today when they test on Monday, it means that um, there was a start of an egg being fertilized and then it failed, which unfortunately means miscarriage for me. Um, but for right now, what he said is, I'm pregnant for the moment, but that could change on Monday or Tuesday at the latest. Um, so I will know more information next week. It wasn't the news that I was hoping to get today, but there is still a chance that I could be pregnant, and it's just too early to tell. I am hoping that it is the beginning um, start of me being pregnant, but we will know more next week. I'm trying not to get my hopes up. I know that there's a possibility and a chance of a miscarriage, and I don't want to go through that, but it is what it is right now. Um, I'm weighing both options and trying to keep myself from leaning towards one side or the other. So I'm kind of stuck in this weird middle and this weird in between and this weird waiting game of knowing but not having answers. Like knowing what's going on but not having answers if that makes sense. So. I just wanted to get on here before Monday.
because I won't forget by then. Because <laughs> we got Christmas in a couple of days and all of that fun stuff. So the next time I update you guys on this will be Monday. So that's that next clip. I know I just ended that clip, but I did forget to say that um, a doctor that I saw did tell me that if I started bleeding between now and Monday, then unfortunately it did, it does mean miscarriage, um, but to let them know immediately so that um, we could kind of do our next steps um, after that. So I just wanted to add that little snippet in here because I forgot to put it in that one. The thing I think is getting me the most is the fact that I have to be prepared to be able to come on here and say I want to have a miscarriage. Hi you guys! I am on my way to my appointment. It is cold outside so I am wearing a beanie. I just started the car not too long ago so I have the heater. Full blast, basically.
try calling before five. Um, to see if I can get the results by that time. But they said that because it's in the afternoon, they probably won't have the results until tomorrow. Which is okay. I am fine with that. I just... I just want to know. I'm hoping that they have the results today, but I know, I, I know, if I call, they're going to say to call back tomorrow, and I just, I don't think I can wait any longer with not knowing. Like, really. I'm on my way home now, obviously. I'm in the car. said that it looked great. I have to go in tomorrow at the same time that I went in yesterday to do a third HCG level. And if it doubles and goes to the 2000s, then the pregnancy looks successful. Um, if not, if it it's higher but it doesn't double then they're going to be a little bit more concerned about it so here's to hoping that it doubles I'm hoping hoping that it doubles 
um, but they said that the levels looked really great and that it was quite a big jump. Um, so right now I'm still pregnant, but it's not a confirmed successful pregnancy. So I am hoping that it is tomorrow I go in and then the day after they will call me with the results. So I will update you back then. I just did my last blood test. I should find out tomorrow. I am hoping that it doubles. I am on my way home now. I am kind of freaking out if I'm being honest. <laughs> 